What's up everybody, Ronington11 here for Ronin Gaming, and we're back with another Battlefield 4 Naval Strike DLC Weapon Unlock. That's right, today we're going to unlock the SR2. This is how you do it, you got to do this assignment called Packing a Punch. It's real simple, got to reach rank 10, you got to have Naval Strike, of course. And you just got to destroy 20 boats. It's that simple. Not hard. Okay, actually, it's, it's a little hard. And by hard, I just mean it's time consuming. Um... Basically, you just got to run around and you just got to find the boats and you got to kill them any way that you possibly can. So I'm going to show you a bunch of the last bunch of times that I killed boats. Basically, I used the javelin mostly the entire time and I just ran back and forth. Um, this one was pretty cool. I got him from the helicopter. So that was a pretty cool one. Uh, you find some very creative ways to get these guys. And, um, you know, uh, like I said, I just ran around and whenever I saw a boat on the minimap, uh, an enemy boat. I just ran to that part of the the island or whatever. Uh, now it doesn't have to be on a naval strike map, okay? It doesn't have to be all in one round. This is going to be a uh, that was pretty good right there with the chain gun. Uh, this is going to be a persistent assignment, meaning it doesn't have to be in one round. Again, no one round. You could just do it over. I mean, this took me maybe like, to be honest, maybe like four or five match. Here we go, a little hide and seek action right here, a little sneaky sneaky action. Yeah, it, it didn't take me, it took me like maybe five matches because in the meantime, I was also trying to get some other assignments, uh, you know, using PDW and trying to get that. And um, I was trying for like three different assignments. So whenever I saw a boat, boom, ran around, grabbed it. You know, the, the, the kit was good because I could use PDWs and I could also use the, the javelin, which was cool. So that's it. Basically, you just got to run around. You got to get these boats and uh, kill them any way necessary. Um, I did kill a bunch of smaller boats, and I think they count, but um, they move pretty quickly. These are kind of either stationary or moving kind of slow, so I was able to get them with the javelin. And um, depending on how close you are or how damaged they are, they will take, you know, one hit. Uh, so this was the last kill right here. This was pretty cool. This was a nice close quarters hit. He was full health, but I got him. Boom, right there. There you go. Packing a punch. Unlock the SR-12. And of course, though, this is a horrible match because um, there's the gun, SR-2. Is that 12? Uh, yeah, I, I get the, the, um, the gunship kept killing me. Uh, pretty bad match. Anyway, here's the SR2. Uh, looks pretty cool. It's a cool gun, high fire rate. Uh, if you burst fire down the, down the barrel, um, pretty decent. Recoil is what it is for a PDW. Um, very high fire rate, very cool, very good in close quarters. Um, medium range, not too bad, I guess, if you put a decent scope on it, although I haven't played it enough with, to get a decent scope. I'm just messing around with the colors here, and, uh, I like this little ripple color, which looks nothing like the actual icon for the ripple color. I don't know why there's a brown in there and there's gray there. I don't know, maybe my graphics card, who knows. But anyway, uh, it comes with a, uh, vertical grip on it, can't change it, that's what it is. And this is what it looks like, I'm just gonna show you a few kills here, and, um... So, see, pretty decent. Uh, I got a headshot with that because that thing was bouncing everywhere. So, pretty cool. But, yeah, guys, that's it. I hope you enjoyed. Um, hope you're enjoying these things. Please subscribe for more Naval Strike stuff, for more Battlefield stuff, and check out my Titanfall stuff. And that's it. Thanks for watching, guys. Peace out.